My name is Marilyn Oberg. I've worked for the BC Ambulance Service for 30 years. I've responded to multiple overdoses, most recently far, far too many fentanyl overdoses. Every day, um, we in Surrey and other officers around the Lower Mainland deal with the fentanyl crisis. We're seeing more overdoses. We're seeing more um, respiratory arrests and cardiac situations you know, with the results of the use of drug use with fentanyl. Fentanyl is a monster. It's killing people. When it was first introduced in, in our scene, um, was being utilized in heroin so that you could use fentanyl and heroin or maybe just fentanyl itself and sell it out on the street. Um, in this day and age, a lot of the other drugs um, are getting inadvertently mixed with it. The user profile of, of fentanyl drug use, there just, there really isn't. There's, there's not one specific person that you could say, this is a person who's a drug user. There's no safe drug use. It's, it's, it's so powerful and so prevalent. It's not just down in the, in the very publicized areas. It's kids, it's teenagers, it's um, um, professionals. It can be someone who lives next door. The risk of drug use is that you just simply have no idea where it's coming from, and you do not know what's in that product. And um, it just takes a little bit of the stuff to knock you out. Often the result is tragic. One of the greatest risks is people who are using alone. That's, a, that's an often a fatal decision. If you are in these situations and you are using drugs, just be aware of who's using them and where they are at all times. The, the thing is to do it where you're safe. Um, naloxone is, is, re is readily available. Um, that's the antidote to this opiate. So the naloxone kit is something that we introduced to our first responder kits in the last um, six months or so. There's a couple needles and then there's some capsules there of, of the medicine. What we hope to see right away is um, a reaction to the medicine where they can get their breathing and their heart rate back. And naloxone saves lives. This doesn't take away from calling 911. This will keep someone alive until the sirens come. A naloxone kit is meant to be a, a band-aid, a first aid measure until 911 gets to you. Naloxone is important, but it's not the only thing you need. You're not going to get in trouble for calling 911. We need to really get the message out to them that it's okay to make that call, to, to that they're not gonna be in trouble and that they need to um, recognize that if they do nothing, that person may lose their life. We've been doing this for years and we come with a compassionate and open heart. Our, our job is not to judge, our job is to help you.